Hey everyone, on this week's Mobility Monday video, I'm going to look at a stretch or a mobilization drill to open up across the chest and the front of the shoulder. Unfortunately, due to modern life, many of us will spend a lot of time either at a computer desk completely hunched over, put around the shoulders, or we're on our phones, or we're driving. This drill is fantastic either for upper body day or just for a little bit of self care and a bit of maintenance to make sure those shoulders stay back open and supple. So, what I've done is I've attached a light band to the rig and I'm going to put my hand through. Turn it like this and gently grip the band. From this position then, I'm going to take a step and I want a little bit of tension on the band. That band is going to assist us in the stretch today. You're going to allow the band to take the hand back this way. You're not going to actively pull on the band. So the hand is turned up and the reason it's turned up is if you turn down, you can see the way my shoulder comes in like this and there's a lot of nerves and vessels in this area here. You don't want to pinch them or kind of tap them down. So turning the hand up the way will open up this whole area here. From this point, you want to turn your body away and you should feel a lovely stretch opening up right across the chest and shoulder along here and you may even feel it into the bicep. Depending on how mobile you are, you may be able to step a little bit further, you may be able to turn away a little bit, but about here is, is okay for me. Again, you don't want to feel a serious stretch. You want to feel it, but you don't want to go to a point where it feels uncomfortable or painful. The only other thing to be wary of is if you're in this position to keep the core engaged and keep the ribcage locked down, you could be in this position, but like this. You want to have complete control over your position to feel a lovely stretch along here. Try that out before your next upper body day or for a little bit of maintenance. If you want to take that to the next level, we want to bring in the neck, okay? We want to bring the stretch up along here. So I'm going to come a little bit close to the camera, just adjust my grip. I'm going to come a little bit close to the camera. So again, we're turned. We're turned away, or our palm up, we're turned away and we're feeling a stretch along here. If you want to feel a little bit more into the neck, there's something very simple you can do. I want you to look away to about 45 degrees, tuck the chin to the chest, and now I'm feeling a beautiful stretch right up along the muscles across the back of the neck. If you want to bring it on a little bit more, again, you can just tick out the chest with the chin. Now I feel that more in this position. So keep it nice and slow, nice and controlled. And if you feel any sort of tingling or numbness going down into the arm, it probably just means that you're going a little bit too far into the stretch and you need to ease off a little bit if you do. Give it a go.